What's going on guys, Black Scout Survival, and today I got a knife review for you, and this is the uh, Martin Knives Lano, Ed Martin Knives. And I've been looking at this knife for years, man, I'm telling you like three or four years, I've been drooling on this knife, and it has a French like trade knife design with a more updated blade profile, uh, kind of, you know, semi-tactical, uh, blade profile, but you know improvements on an old design basically and makes it more modern and able to use for a lot of different situations. This is a quarter inch piece of S35 VN so you could you know put this thing in a vise and it ain't going to break. It has a drop point design with a swedge on the front. The swedge is really just for you know penetration. A lot of uh, military guys uh you know different uh, operators carry uh ed martin knives so that's a uh, important feature but you don't have to get it you can get it without the swedge as well but you know being able to stab uh in a combat situation it is a uh, five inch blade you can also get a six inch uh a saber grind as you can see here um has a micarta handles this is green micarta and then you can see I've got hollow pins here and I really really like that hollow pins it looks really good um, if you can see that mine does have red liners as well and you can see the jimping is is very uh, nice jimping very unique it, it doesn't hurt your hand at all it gives it good grip uh, but it has like kind of like relief points on there so it's not sharp uh, it doesn't hurt your hand like a lot of people complain and it has a lanyard hole in the rear here but grabbing the knife and using I really do love it that uh kind of trade handle there feels really good in the hand so I think you really hit it out of the park with this knife um, I'm telling you it's easy to use comfortable and it's a good good solid survival knife using bushcraft situations whatever you, you want to do now let's go ahead and look at the sheath. This is the multi-carry sheath and it is a deep carry. It carries deep in the, so you're not gonna lose your blade no matter what, which is important. It's very deep and it has this retention strap. You can carry it on your hip with the belt loop here. You can take the belt loop off, carry it ambidextrous like I was carrying it. Then you can also reverse it and carry it scout on the center of your back if you'd like. This one includes a uh, pouch in the front here so what you have here is some tools to maintain the blade it's a sharpening stone and also has a hook sharpener there as well and then a piece of uh, foam padding on the back so what you do here is you take this grit uh, sandpaper he's got here to hone that blade up and you place it with that padding there so Whenever you go across it, it uh, works as a good uh, sharpening system there. Very, very smart for Ed. And you know, this is coming from somebody that makes knives. They know what they're doing. They know how to maintain a blade. Then it also has a fair seam rod with striker. So, you know, you got your cutting tool, fire making stuff and a way to maintain your blade. And you can carry this in a multi uh, multitude of, of different uh, carries but the Lano is uh, a, na a town in Texas um, so that's what's named out of and that's where Ed Martin is from like I said there's a lot of other options available um, through his website that you can choose uh, and pretty much design this knife any way you'd like so definitely go check out Ed Martin knives I'll put the link to this knife in the uh, description box. Like I said, it, man, it's, it's one of my uh, new favorites. Very good feeling, tough knife. Uh, you know, Ed does this all by hand, so definitely go check him out. Make sure you subscribe to our channel because we put out a few new videos every week. And as always, thanks for watching.